Hi students! Welcome back again to another episode of Learning. For today's video, pag-aaralan natin ang percentiles for group data. So let's have the formula. Kung napanood nyo yung previous videos ko on uh, deciles and quartiles of group data, ang pinalitan lang dito is itong 100. Okay, so that is K over 100 times N kasi nga ang percentile ay natin ang data into 100 equal parts. Okay, sa quartile ito ay 4, sa decile ito ay 10. Okay, so we have here L is the lower boundary or lower class boundary of the P sub K class. N is the total frequency. Less than CFB is the less than cumulative frequency before the P sub K class. F is the frequency of the P sub K class and W is the width of the class interval. So let's have the first example. Calculate P sub 26, P sub 48, and P sub 91 of the data below. Okay, so ang ating class interval is naka-arrange siya from lowest to highest. Okay, so minsan hindi binibigay yung uh, less than cumulative frequency. So para masundan nyo siya, we have here 5, 5, 5 plus 8 is 13, 13 plus 10, 23, 23 plus 12 is 35, 35 plus 4 is 39, and 39 plus 11 is 50. So that's why N here or the total frequency is 50. So pwede rin nyo ring, so pwede nyo ring i-plus ito. Okay. First solve for P sub 26, so that is K over 100 times N. So 26 over 100, yung 26 na kuha natin dito sa uh, 26 percentile, ang 50 is the total frequency. So this is equal to 13. So the percentile class is the row with closest less than CF that is greater than 13. This is 23. Okay, so ito yung ating P sub 26 class. Based on the P sub 26 class, we have the following. So, the lower boundary is 40.5. 40 plus 41 over 2. Ito yon. So, less than CF before is 13. Frequency is 10. Ito yon. And the width of the class interval is 10. So, 50 minus 41 plus 1 is equal to 10. Okay? So, you can use any interval here dahil pare-pareho lang naman sila ng width. So, using this formula and by substitution, we have 40.5 plus 13 minus 13 over 10 times 10 is equal to 40.5 dahil 0 na yung part na to. Next, we have P sub 48. So, P, uh, 48 over 100 times 50 is equal to 24. So, the percentile class is the row with closest less than CF that is greater than 24. This is 35. So, ito yung ating P sub 48 class. Based on the P sub 48 class, we have the following. Lower boundary is 50.5. That is 50 plus 51 over 2. Less than CF before is 23. Ito yon. Frequency here is 12, ito yon, and width of the class interval is 10. Hindi naman siya nabago. So, using this formula and by substitution, 50.5 plus 24 minus 23 over 12 times 10 is approximately equal to 51.33. Next, for P sub 91, we have 91 over 100 times 50 is equal to 45.5. So, the percentile class is the row with closest less than CF that is greater than 45.5, which is 50. Okay, so ito yung ating P sub 91 class. So, based on the P sub 91 class, we have the following. L is, or the lower boundary is 70.5. That is 70 plus 71 over 2. So, less than CF before is 39. Uh, ito yon. F is 11, the frequency, ito yon, and width is 10. Okay, so using this formula by substitution, 70.5 plus 45.5 minus 39 over 11 times 10 is approximately equal to 76.41. Next, we have the second example. This time, ang ating class interval ay naka-arrange from uh, greatest to least. Okay, so we have the less than CF uh, less than cumulative frequency, magsisimula tayo sa baba. So, 5, 5, 5 plus 12 is 17, 17 plus 8 is 25, 25 plus 11 is 36, 36 plus 4 is 40, and 40 plus 5 is 45. So, that means ang total frequency natin ay 45. So, first solve for P sub 35. So, 35 over 100 times 45 is equal to 15.75. So, the percentile class here is this row. 
okay? This is the closest less than CF greater than 15.75, okay? So, that is 17. Based on the P sub 35 class, we have the following. Lower boundary is 15.5. Ito yun, 15 plus 16 over 2. Less than CF before is 5. Ito yun. Frequency of the percentile class, ito yun, 12. And width is 5. So, 20 minus 16 plus 1 is 5. Using this formula and then by substitution, 15.5 plus 15.75 minus 5 over 12 times 5 is approximately equal to 19.98. Next, we have P sub 57. So, 57 over 100 times 45 is equal to 25.65. The percentile class is the row with closest less than CF that is greater than 25.65. So, this is 36. Ito yung ating P sub 57 class. Next, based on the P sub 57 class, we have the following. Lower boundary is 25.5. That is 25 plus 26 over 2. Less than CF before is 25. Ito yun. Uh, frequency is 11. Ito yun. And width is 5. So, using the formula by substitution, 25.5 plus 25.65 minus 25 over 11 times 5 is approximately equal to 25.8. Next, for P sub 82, so 82 over 100 times 45 is 36.9. Okay, so ang ating P sub 82 class ay itong row na ito. Okay. Based on P sub 82 class, we have the following. Lower boundary is 30.5. 30 plus 31 over 2 yan. Less than CF before is 36. Frequency is 4. Ito yon. And the width is 5. Okay, so using the formula and by substitution, we have 30.5 plus 36.9 minus 36 over 4 times 5 is equal to 31.625. So that's it for today's lesson. I hope you learn a lot. Thank you and have a nice day. Goodbye.